watch your videos. I appreciate and it, bro. Boxing. I appreciate it. All right, guys. Dante, 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 All right. I was gonna ask you who was gonna win, but I don't have to ask now. What's up? What's up, y'all? All right, y'all. Uh -huh. Taste box and they yeah, my man, my man. Canelo. Canelo. Taste Boxing Nation. I'm over here with trainer Chris. You were working. You were working like Dale Rose Corner when he fought against Sergey um, Lipinit. Um, go ahead and tell me about that fight because it looked like he started off really well. He was dominating the first five rounds and then he started to slow down and yeah. then... We, we knew, I mean, we knew Sergey was a, was a legitimate fighter. You know, even though he only has seven fights, he got a vast amateur experience, got kickboxing experience. Um, so, I mean, we're, and he's a lot bigger than Liddell. You know, we kind of just, and I got brought in three weeks after the fight was already made. Uh, so we went in there with the idea of confusing, unboxing, moving, and uh, Lipidus had some good pressure. Uh, his last fight, he knocked out a 17 and 0 guy. The fight before that, he knocked out a 9 and 0 guy. Um, you know, I kind of a lot of people felt Liddell didn't have a chance at all, and uh, you know, we went in, to, we went in it to win it, and just kind of slowed down a little bit after halfway through the fight. Um, the, the point for holding was kind of BS. Oh yeah, yeah, that and, was ridiculous. Uh, and, the one judge without that would have had it right. The other judges that gave all eight rounds to the Russian, I don't know, because yeah. Adele boxed the shit out of them the first yeah. six, five. At least first the one. first five or six yeah. rounds. Yeah, yeah. 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 Um, so, what, did, what did Rose say about it afterwards? How was his demeanor? I mean, he, he was, it's, it's hard to be po uh, positive off a loss, especially your first loss after 24 fights. Um, he handled like a champ. He sees the big picture, knows where we're going. We're going to move him down to 135, then to 130. And I think you'll see a, a whole new Liddell Rhodes. He'll be going to people, not trying to box and move them. He'll stop uh, people. He'll be a beast in that weight class. So I'm really excited to see the progression and where we're going to go with it. Okay. So when it comes to Sergey, you see him going pretty far at that division then, or, or what? Yeah, I, I definitely see him at 140, maybe 147. Uh, he can't go smaller. He's a big guy. Um, there's some, there's some, there'll be somebody his size that can box that might give him some, some problems. Yeah, you know? like you said, someone his natural yeah. size. Yeah. Yeah, who he, can keep him off? Who can keep him off? He got a little right? bit more, you know, in the tank to keep him off. He yeah. would have made the difference. And, and I thought Liddell had some wicked punches and actually rocked him a couple times. Uh, you can see Sergey visually frustrated with what Liddell was doing. His manager couldn't believe that Liddell went the distance. Yeah. He's he he like, he like telling you, this guy knocks everybody out. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Not knocking us out, so. Yeah, he didn't even knock him down. No. So. Yeah, interesting, man. Well, thanks for your time, man. Look forward to seeing him in the future, man. I appreciate it. Thanks. Thanks.